So Cardi B and Nicki Minaj were seen fighting at the Fashion Awards and it got very physical and Cardi B just went left. Once all units, second floor terrorism ASAP. Once all units, second floor. Uh huh, you got him? Yeah, I got him. Today, so I'm sure everybody has heard the news of Cardi B and Nicki Minaj who were fighting at the Fashion Awards. Cardi B just lost it and she just went left and she attempted to throw her shoe at Nicki Minaj and apparently Nicki Minaj was just calm and cool as a cucumber, wasn't saying anything, wasn't doing anything and she was just sitting there watching the mess unfold second by second and Ra Ali actually got to Nicki Minaj's defense and got into that scuffle and I was really thinking this has nothing to do with you so what are you doing? The security were there to help the situation so why do you need to involve yourself who damn well knows but you know Riley's probably about that life because she's about the reality TV love and hip-hop nonsense but these two got into an intense scuffle because Cardi B didn't like the fact that Nicki Minaj was apparently speaking about or liking comments that were pertaining to Cardi B's child now whilst I do agree kids are off limits we have to also discuss what would this do for Cardi B in terms of progressiveness for her own self as a person like did you really play yourself but you didn't really end up hitting Nicki Minaj and you ended up coming back out with a lost shoe and a bruise on top of your forehead on the side. So like, what did you gain from it? But at the end of the day, that brings a massive publicity to both of them. It will help both of them in their own way. But Queen Radio will be on tomorrow and we damn well know Nicki will probably mention it. But it was, a, but it was a, a situation that we thought would never have happened. Cardi B actually lets loose on Instagram and she says, I've let a lot of shit slide. I let you sneak diss me. I let you lie on me. I let you attempt to stop my bags. Fuck up the way I eat. You've threatened other artists in the industry. Told them if they work with me, you'll stop fucking with me. I let you talk big shit about me. I addressed you once in person. I addressed you a second time in person. And every time you copped the plea. But when you mention my child, you choose to like comments about me as a mother. Make comments about my ability to take care of my daughter as when all bets are effing off. I've worked too hard and come too far to let anybody F with my success. Bitches talk all that shit in their raps, but in real life, they pussy. This shit really is for entertainment. So really and truly, she just was tired of it. So this is probably going on for a very, very long time. And Cardi B really just breached her threshold and she just lost it. Now, was this a good thing for her to do? Who don't know? Some people would obviously support her and say how real she is. You know, this is how she is from with 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 success or without success she really hasn't changed it's just being herself and the other other people would just say woo child the ghetto as nini leaks always says they get her to the fullest was that really a good thing for her to do now that she's elevated who damn well knows but at the end of the day this is a situation that had and everybody's going to be talking about it and it's definitely going to help both them in a certain way but also work against them i feel in a certain way as well Nicki minaj is getting some slander but at the end of the day the video that was shown was a bad quality video so we didn't get to see much of it but what we do see Nicki minaj is just standing there called as a cucumber doing nothing saying nothing so it's quite interesting because some people are saying that the comments that were supposedly made or that Nicki Minaj liked were apparently photoshopped so all of it was just for nonsense but the other people saying it weren't who damn well knows Remy Ma and obviously we was talking about it prior a while ago about how Nicki Minaj helps to stop somebody's bag and stop that money and once you do that you're stopping food getting for their children and obviously people are going to be doing certain things when their children have been affected because that is your child as far as trying to keep me off of red carpets and trying to make sure awards don't go to me or she's not going to be in attendance or trying to get people to make bad reports about my album sales or just anything that I'm doing to make me look less and make her look better and I have a problem when you're trying to stop my bag when you're trying to stop me from taking care of my children now I have a problem you know it is your child and then obviously Azealia Banks wanted to add her two cents into the situation because obviously she always does and she's spoken about both these ladies so this will probably be her time to shine in a way and she obviously made her video oh Cardi you're a bird <laughs> You're a bird. I told y'all bitches she was a bird. I told y'all, like, listen, she doesn't understand the rules of black female etiquette. She doesn't understand that black women in 2018, we fight with our words and not with our hands. Woo child, the ghetto, the campesino. But at the end of the day, I didn't receive this comment. I woke up to this news and I'm thinking, what's going on between Nikki and Cardi? Like, they're both pretty good rappers. 
they're obviously, you know, very successful ladies and they're pitting themselves against each other like this. It's actually quite sad. But at the same time, I think everybody wanted them to fight or argue. Like, but at the end of the day, Cardi B has had enough. Clearly, Nicki is doing something. And, you know, is Nicki Minaj becoming the common denominator? Because she isn't the only one that has said this about her stopping her back. Lil' Kim said it. You know, Remy Ma said it. So who knows? We don't know what's going on. But at the end of the day, I feel like it was good for Nicki to be called as a cucumber and not do anything. I feel like her being physical would have acted in her demise. But at the same time, she had this energy with Miley Cyrus on the VMA stage in 2015 so where was that energy now maybe because she didn't see it coming who knows let me know what you guys think of this entire debacle what team are you on team Cardi B team Nikki or team neither let me know what you guys think of this particular video and I will definitely catch you guys soon and please follow me on Instagram I would appreciate the love thank you very much